Good morning, Stephanie Cameron, the Stock Whisperer, here with today's Daily Dog Pool Whisper of the Day. It is Wednesday, March 8th, and uh, guess what? Powell will be speaking again today, so we can ex expect more possible downside. The market did not like what he had to say yesterday. Um, we are almost heading outside of yesterday's candle. We just kind of pulled up a little bit, so we'll see what happens. We're going to be bullish above 401.50, bear below 397.50. We came pretty close, 14 cents shy, but uh, we did not trigger yet. So watch that level. But guess what? We got a new massive dark pool level on the SPY, 404.44, 8 million. That was a biggie yesterday. Yeah, so in the bigger picture, swing picture, we need to close above that. Uh, but we'll see. Let's go to the IWM. All right, kind of stuck inside yesterday's candle as well. And that 50 simple moving average is kind of right below us. We got the 250 EMA above us. Not a great spot. We'll hope it breaks free. We're going to be bullish above 188.50. And bear below 186.75. Let's check out the NASDAQ QQQ. Also inside yesterday's candle and in between the 4 and the 8 EMA. Not a great spot either. Bullish above 298.50. Bear below 295.80. Let's check out those futures. We're going to start with the E-minis. Bullish above 40.15. And bear below 39.80. Came close, but really looking at this pocket right here, this is our downside trade. Yeah, really nice if we can break below there. If not, we might have an uphill battle to fight going up. Let's check out the NASDAQ futures. Bullish above 12,250, bear below 12,150. 50. All right, let's check out oil. What is oil doing? Mm, kind of flatlining. Yeah, we're kind of stuck also in between this pivot. See this pivot box? Yeah, it's like the worst place to trade. We'll be bullish above it, 78.50, and bear below it, 76. Actually, I sliced and diced here. Bear below 76.80. Let's check out gold futures. And we're going to be bullish above 1831, above the pivot box as well, and bear below 1814. And last but not least is the Bitcoin, oops, Bitcoin futures. If I can type this out, be good. Here we go. Bullish above 23,000 all the way up here, bear below 21,750. All right, let's check out the individual stocks. We're going to start with Tesla. All right, here we go. Yep, looks pretty bearish. The four cross below the eight EMA on the daily chart. The trend has turned to the downside. Uh, bear below 185 today. And uh, if you missed that level, 184 is another good level. Uh, bullish above 190 for a retrace. Let's check out BABA. That had a lot of pre-market volume this morning. Bullish above 89.25 for a retrace. Bear below 86.80. NEO bullish above 920 today. Bear below 850. We got a new print yesterday at 905. So we'll see. Uh, which way Neo wants to go, but uh, Palantir Technologies PLTR bullish above 855. Bear below 8. You know, this is a good swing trade as well. There's really a nice pocket here or to the downside trade right there. Uh, let's check out Oxy. Doesn't normally make the list, but had a lot of volume this morning popping up here. Bullish above 63. We've got some resistant trend line uh moving averages i should say above us um and then bear below 62 on oxy all right let's check out meta today bullish above 186.50 bear below 182 we've got apple next bullish above 153.50 
bare below 150. Nvidia, we're going to be bullish above 239, bear below 229.50. And Amazon had that really big print yesterday, 94.65. So maybe they're done. Maybe they're going to move this finally. Bullish above 95, bear below 92.80. There you have it. Those are your whispers for Wednesday, March 8th. Until next time, happy trading, everybody. My secret